days a day A banner's always a coming my way So today we are in St. Augustine, Florida visiting the St. Augustine Lighthouse. This should be interesting and it's supposed to be hot. Now looking up towards the top of the lighthouse as each spiral, think of that as a different level. They were able to look up there and see somebody peeking over like that person right there. And then as a moment later, it'd be up two more levels. And it would almost like they were playing hide and go seek on the staircase to the lighthouse. So we are gonna go up to the top right now. Now the staircase is getting smaller, so to speak. The circles are coming to a point, which means one thing. We are getting to the very top of the lighthouse, almost to the observation deck. Uh, oh, man. Hey, even with your Holy crap. Oh, gosh. oh geez. That's straight down. Technically, you can see the bottom of the lighthouse right there. Well, hello. This is the St. Augustine Lighthouse here in St. Augustine, Florida. I'm Stu, your friendly volunteer. Been doing this about nine years. The lighthouse itself is 165 feet tall, second tallest in Florida ninth tallest on the East Coast. We started constructing this one in uh, the spring of 1871 and October 15, 1874 lit off the light for the very first time. It has a first order Fresnel lens. This guy, this old Frenchman, uh, French mathematician Fresnel, he figured out in his head in 1822, he didn't have a computer to figure it out, how to build something that would catch your light and focus it into a beam. So he did all that in 1822 and then a bunch of Frenchmen in 1871, by hand, made our first order Fresnel lens following his directions. And that's the lens that's up there now, and it still works. We are really high up here. I can honestly say that I am absolutely terrified of heights. I don't know what I would do if this thing would topple over. And everybody's watching, and I just said that. So. Welcome to St. Augustine Lighthouse. These are some guys that we met at the top of the lighthouse here in St. Augustine. No idea who you guys are, but they're up here hanging out, <laughs> watching us film, so. Hello. Hey. 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 I feel like I could jump off here and be Mary Poppins right now. So I'm guessing that's the bridge in the college that we came by from the top there. Oh, 
did it. We did it. Both terrified of heights. Have you looked down yet? No. Taylor won't look down, but we looked down. I took you guys to the top. Looks very bottom. If you look over far enough, you can see the very bottom of the lighthouse. There she is. It's her new parasol. Looking absolutely gorgeous, especially when she smiles. Shut up. <laughs> Now that we're up here at the very top, there's where we started and started the video. Oh, Jesus. Chris is still sitting down there. So Chris didn't want to come up to the very top, but we told him that we'd call him when we get up here, and I could see his, his cane. I could see his legs. Can you see him? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You made me look down, Michael. Sorry. He's at the keeper's house. Now, it is really bright and we are off to other things, but St. Augustine Lighthouse is absolutely beautiful and it has a beautiful view overlooking the ocean. We met some really interesting people. Very nice kids came up to us asking what we were doing. Of course we told them. YouTube. It's a wonderful thing. One of the best parts about what we do and where we travel is, of course, the places we meet, but even more important, importantly, the people we meet along the way. My legs are shaking walking down. Same. Oh my god. <laughs>